I'm so tired. Oh. I haven't ridden in over a week. This is what I get. Today's my day off, so I'm out here riding by myself, sticking to mostly legal stuff. <laughs> or pretty much all legal stuff. I don't know. Ever since we started cross country riding, like, I'm not that intrigued to do any of the crazy steep stuff that we have around here. Everyone around me says to try it, but my bike's a cross country bike. I'll leave it at that. And uh, ever since going to Sea Otter, Edward and I have talked about participating in some of the cross country races next April. <laughs> Obviously, we've never participated in any races, so I don't know. Pretty scary, but it could be fun. It could be a fun experience if we actually get to do it. Huh. I think I know that person. Ah, oh, he's already going down. All right. So Edward and I call this trail Bay Leaf North out here on Pleasanton Ridge. It's also labeled as like Sinbad Trails. People call it the Seven Switchbacks. Ooh, man. Yes, this dirt. <laughs> okay, why well, not? I'm not gonna do anything crazy. Keep it safe on me. Excited to see the dirt down at the actual switchbacks really tight ones down here. It's been so dry and dusty, so this will be cool. Whoa. Okay, careful, careful. Oh no, I should take my sunglasses off. Oh man, crap, it's super dark. Should have brought my lights or something. Oof, oops, there's a rock there. Okay, ran right over that rock. Oh my God. Someone's, oh no. Oh, duh, landslide. Wow, that sucks. Yeah, we, the rains were massive. Just on Sunday, it rained nonstop. So that probably caused that to fall off. Damn, that sucks. Oh. My language. Oh man. Oh yeah, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. Oh crap. Should I spend a minute and try and clean this off? This is like probably super pointless to do this, but oh well. Gotta contact East Bay Regional Parks. And rebuild the trails. Oh, yeah. God, about that. If Eduardo and I really do do the sea otter cross country races, he's thinking we sign up for Cat 2. Well, at first we were both like, let's do Cat 3, obviously, we've never raced before. But then he was thinking, let's train so that we can do Cat 2. But I don't know. I think I should just stick with Cat 3. Uh, I was watching some of the races on YouTube that people have posted from this past sea otter. Oh, seems pretty intimidating, especially how they like 
start people, start the waves in such close proximity of each other. I really wouldn't want to have pros, you know, behind me doing their, you know, the long route and stuff, the long course. Anyway, hope I'm going the right way. Oh yeah, I think it's just over. Wait, what? Oh God, where am I? No, I should be fine. I think I just saw a turtle go in. Where are you turtles? Anyway, so Eduardo and I have talked about like how we could train for a race. Oops. Oops. <laughs> Back here. <laughs> yeah, that's that's how I'll train. <laughs> but we talked about getting me a heart rate monitor. He has one. And I don't know, like getting pretty serious about it. I, I just I don't want to get too serious because I feel like the more effort I put into it, the more disappointed I'll be if I don't do well. And I know everyone's going to say it's just for fun, blah, blah, blah. I'm, I'm not a competitive person at all, but like if I'm surrounded by other people that are competitive, it kind of stresses me out. So we'll see. Like, even if we don't actually do it in the end, because it's really, it's not easy to race the otter. I mean, you have to think about how to get there. You go spend the night, reservations, and it's a lot of money. But yeah, so even if we don't do it, it's kind of, it'd be kind of cool to like still train for it because I don't know, I want to get stronger. I would love to just keep pushing and pushing and, you know, having a race be your goal obviously can give you a purpose, right? The next step though would be to clip in. My coworker gave me his, some spare or old uh, pedals, but he gave me his old SPDs and I have some SPD shoes that I've had for a long time I've never worn because I've always stuck with flats. But now that I've gotten into cross country and if I really do want to train for this race, like. I know it makes sense to clip in. Just haven't gone around to it. You know, I know Eduardo would be amazing in a cross country race. I think he should do Cat One. Like, I think he should train for Cat One, but he doesn't want to. Thing I need to start doing more is climbing off the saddle. But, oh god, that's so tiring on the whole legs. I have no muscle there. Anyway, thanks for joining me. Hero Dirt at Pleasanton Ridge. See you later. Bye.